I, Abhinav, you sanjit Nams, hereby welcome you all to a 55 virtual meeting of Purangal Club. The mission of the Gavalier Club, the mission of a Gavalier Club is to provide a supportive and positive learning experience in which members are empowered to develop communication and leadership skills, resulting in greater self-confidence and personal growth. May I now request you to unmute your mics and turn off any noise-making devices such as mobile phones, which may disturb you during the meeting. You are also requested to refrain from talking anything related to sex, politics, or religion. To keep the decorum of the virtual meeting and to facilitate the speakers to perform at their best, all are requested to keep your mic mute until it is required you to speak and to avoid any distraction while the speaker is speaking. All attendees are requested to familiarize with the chat and reaction buttons. Fit yourself well in the screen and have adequate lighting, mindful of your background and speakers to have the speaking area ready. I now request Gavalia Devadan Nair to come to the screen to start the proceedings of the meeting. Thank you, Sajana Tams. When you have a dream, all the universe conspires in helping you to achieve it. A quote rightly said by Paulo Coelho in his bestseller book, The Alchemist. Dear Toastmasters, Gavaliers and guests, a very good morning to one and all. Togetherness is the basic instinct of human being, which marked the foundation stone for the development from ancient civilization to the success of most modern multi-billion business empires. For instance, Larry Page was not alone to make Google a reality, but his friend Sergi Brin was with him. Cristiano Ronaldo is definitely a good footballer, but the team was always there to support him whenever he needs them either in the field or off the field. According to an Indian epic, a student attains 25% of knowledge from his teacher, another one quarter through his own intelligence, the next one quarter comes to him from the influence of time, and the last one quarter from his fellow students. So learning itself is not a solo activity, but a team effort. The best way to learn something is to learn it together through discussions and from other people's experiences. If we examine history, either in the field of studies, business, sports, or in any other field, teamwork is seen as the cornerstone for greatness and success. So let's have an amazing meeting by engaging and motivating together. Delegation is the basic quality of a leader as one person cannot handle all the responsibilities and take the team to success. Being the leader of today's meeting, I have delegated several responsibilities to my fellow Gavaliers and I will be introducing them one by one. To know more about learning together and growing together, let me welcome Gavalier Mothersim as our one minute Gavalier to elate us with a short note on the topic. Good afternoon, dear Cavaliers and guests. Today, I am the One Minute Cavalier. As a One Minute Cavalier, my role is to elaborate the theme of the day, which is, which is together we learn, together we grow. First, there is a famous quote by famous author, Helen Keller. She says, she says that, if we learn alone, it is so little, but if we learn together, it is so much. Together we learn, together we grow means that if you learn, if you do any big work or hard work alone, it will take so much time. And if you do the same work with other friends or your friends or other people, it will take so less time and it will be so easily to finish the work. Thank you and back to you. Thank you, Gavler Mothazim. 
Now, let's call the knowledge capsule. He is going to give us some new information. So, please help me invite Gavler Abhinav Knowledge Capsule. Thank you, Gavler Pradee. Okay, so I don't want to give an introduction because I don't want to bore you all. So, starting off with some news from today. Elon Musk has said on Twitter that he would immediately sell shares of his electric car company, Tesla, which is worth more than a trillion dollars if the UN could explain how the money would solve world hunger. And now, some general knowledge that you should or should not know. Do you know that India used to be an island 100 million years ago, but about yes. 50 million years ago, it collided with Asia. Thus, the Himalayas were born. A four-hour drive from Arunangabad and doubling as Maharashtra's best-kept secret, this lake was created by a plummeting meteor 52 years ago, holding the Guinness World Book of Records for the highest average rainfall. This town in Meghalaya gets about 11,000 millimeters of rain owing to its proximity to Bay of Bengal. The winter months of this region are spent in preparation for six month long monsoons ahead. Can you guess what it is? Hmm, it doesn't look like it. A small village in Jaipur, district of Uttar Pradesh, has created history for producing the most number of IAS officers. With about 75 households, it has given 47 officers to the Indian administration. Thank you and have a great day. Thank you, Gavler Abhinav, for that knowledge capsule. Communication is the basic need of any teamwork, either it be verbal or non-verbal. For us to improve our verbal communication and well present ourselves, we need to have good grammar skills. This matter today will be taken care by our grammarian, Gavler Asim Muhammad. Gavler Asim. Please explain your role as grammarian and eludicate the word of the day. Thank you, Gary, of today. Uh, I request the host to please enable sc uh, screen sharing. Yes, you can, Mr. President. Uh, it's disabled, sir. I think so. Now it is unable, sir. Yes, sir. Now it's okay. unable. Okay. Good morning to one and all present here. Today's word is elate. E L A T E. Elate. The meaning of this word is to make someone very happy, but mainly through doing a huge favor or through positive thoughts being instilled to someone. Whenever we see our friend looking so depressed, we often say and console him, telling that we, they will have better chances in the future. At that time, we are elating them. And that's what elate means, to make someone very happy and very confident and very energetic. The word elate is a word. Since elate means to make someone very happy, and making someone very happy is an action. Therefore, it is a word. The synonyms of this word are exhilarated, thrilled, happy, delighted, exultant, overjoyed, joyous, and jubilant. All of these mean happy. The antonyms of this word are miserable, sad, depressed, sorrowful, unhappy, down, and disappointed. Notice that down is used as the antonym of elate and as a synonym of sad. This is because down has two meanings. One is the direction that is pointing below, and the other is looking very sad or depressed. When we are sad, we always look down. We don't look up. And that's why down is more commonly used to also represent sadness or 
becoming sorrowful. Like every other English word, elate has also its other forms. Some of the forms are elation, elatedly, and elated. Elation is the noun form of the word, meaning great happiness and exhilaration. A sentence with this word is, Richard's elation at regaining his health was short-lived. Elatedly is the adverb form of the word, meaning very happy or jubilant. A sentence with this word is, science has elatedly now found that all children learn better, grow up to become more confident and have better self-esteem. Elated is the adjective form, meaning ecstatically happy. Notice that elated is the adjective form of the word elate and also the past tense of the word. This is because when we use the word, uh, the past tense of the word elate, we normally use it to describe a noun, not to uh, describe an action. For example, he was elated after winning the contest. Here, we are describing he more than the action, how he felt. That is why elated is more commonly used as an adjective more than the past, a past form of the word elate. A sentence with this word is, after the concert, I felt elated. Every word has its own origin and its first known use. For elate, it also has its specific origins. The word elate was derived from a Latin word, elatus, meaning to carry out or to elevate. It was the past participle form of the Latin word fer, meaning carry. To carry out or to elevate here was used in poetic sense as to bring one into higher spirits and make them more happy and energetic. That's why elatus was used to uh, uh, express someone to become very high and to bring them into higher spirits. And that's how elate was formed with the same poetic meaning. The first known use of this word was in 1619 as the word form that is elate. Now, let's look at some of the sentences with this word. The discovery of ancient life forms has elated researchers and was the key point in the history of the earth. The winning of the FIFA World Cup elated the whole town into a big celebration. Thank you, and remember to always use the word elate in your speeches and table topics. Once again, the word is elate, E-L-A-T-E. -E. The meaning of the word is make someone very happy. So let's have a fun-filled and elate meeting today. Thank you and have a nice day ahead. Thank you, Gavler Asim. Now, please help me invite Gavler Mautism to share the minutes of the previous meeting. Good evening, dear, good afternoon, dear Gavler. Again, club number 0731. 6579 District 79 Minutes of the 51st Meeting of Prudent Girl Club Division O Online Meeting Number 54 It was held on 22nd of October 2021 The meeting was opened by President Gavilar Ishan at 9:30 a.m. and invited Gavilar of the Day Gavilar Priya Darshan Attendance were Gavilars were 16 and total number were 15 Meeting was adjourned by President Gavilar Ishan at 11.44 a.m. Club number 3723665, District 79, minutes of the 138th meeting of Kiletu Gavilar Club. Online meeting number 53, it was held on 12th of November 2021. The meeting was opened by President Gavilar Devitri at 9.04 a.m. and invited by Gavilar of the day. Gavilar Haya. Educational session was they had workshop by DTM Farheen says ma'am on the topic a fruitful feedback and by DTM NC Mani sir on how to attempt speech in contest. Attendance were 
Gavilliers were total of twenty one, and Toastmasters were three. Total were twenty four. Meeting was adjourned by President Gavilliers Devishri at eleven fifty three a.m. Thank you. Thank you, Gavilliers Mathasim. Completion of the task within the stipulated time is the motto of any team. To keep track of today's timings, we have our inquisitive Gavilliers Gavilliers Ayan to explain the role of time. Good morning, Toastmasters, Gavilliers, and guests. Today, I will be the timer for this meeting. I will keep track of the time of the speeches, evaluations, and table topic speeches. I will, I will give the timings when I will be called upon. The timings for the speakers are for prepared speech speakers. Uh, Prepared speech speakers, four to five icebreaker timer, four to five minutes, four minutes green, four minutes thirty seconds yellow, five minutes red. For prepared speech speakers, dear timer, dear timer, Gavilar Ayan, please check agenda. it was clearly mentioned the timing for the prepared speakers has 4 to 6 minutes okay sir and again display the cards accordingly and announce the timings as per the sessions thank you okay sir ice breaker ice breaker speeches 4 to 6 minutes 4 minutes green 5 minutes yellow and 6 minutes red for prepared speeches other than ice breaker 5 to 6 minutes 5 to 7 minutes 5 minutes green 6 minutes yellow and 7 minutes red for table topic speeches 1 to 2 minutes with a grace period of 30 seconds 1 minute green 1 minute 30 seconds yellow and 2 minutes red timing for evaluators 2 to 3 minutes 2 minutes green 3 uh, 2 minutes 30 seconds yellow and 3 minutes red with this thank you and back to the gavilar report thank you gavilar ayan for the brief description on the timing limits One of the most important benefits of teamwork is mutual identification of rooms for improvement, leading to mutual growth. Our teammate Gavilar Mathasim will help us to improve our seamless flow of our communication today by playing the role of our counter. Gavilar Mathasim, please explain your role as our counter. Greetings, dear guests and fellow Gavilar. The purpose of the our counter is to note words. and sounds that are used as a crutch or pause filler by anyone who speaks during the meeting i have listened for overused words including and well but so and you know i will also listen for filler sounds including a um and or i will also note when a speaker repeats a word or a phrase such as i i or this means this means At the end of the meeting, I will report the number of times that each speaker used these expressions. Thank you. Thank you, Gavilar Mathasim. We surely will try our best to avoid such hesitations. A successful team always appreciates the best players to reward their efforts and also to motivate others to excel. So does our team. We have Gavar Gavilar Abhinav Gorantala to play the role of vote counter. Gavilar Abhinav, please explain your role as vote counter. Gali of the day, respected to smasters and my dear fellow Gavilars and guests, a very good morning to all of you. Today, I am going to be the vote counter for the day. In a Gavilars club, each member has the right to choose the best speaker of his of his or her choice. and the results are going to be declared based on the votes casted by the members there will be a, there will be a poll raised by dtn marsimara you can vote and i will be announcing the results 
I request only Gavaliers to cast their votes. Guests, please refrain from voting. I'll submit my report when called upon by the Gavali of the day or general evaluator. Dear vote counter, today we are going to have manual method of having our voting system. So each and every Gavalier should send their ballot to the vote counter, which is Gavalier Abhinav. Thank you. Thank you, Gavilar Abhinav, for that brief explanation. As communication is a key factor in teamwork, listening skill of each team member is vital. To test the listening skills of our team members, we have the listening master of the day, Gavilar Ishant Ramasamy. Good morning, dear light Gavilar, Chosen Masters, and my dear kids. My role today is of listening master. It is my duty today to check how much attention the participants pay what is happening during the meeting. The purpose of this role is to help people become more focused and have fun. At the end of the meeting, I shall ask members questions about the meeting. Questions will be picked from today's meeting, such as things speakers say or things that has happened. Wish you a happy listening and back to you, Gallery of the Day. Thank you, Gavilar Ishant. In a team, rather than having a strict environment, it's more recommended to have a friendly one. This will improve the team bonding. To keep this friendly and fun atmosphere in our team, please help me invite our fun master, Gavilar Aditya. Thank you, Gavilar of the day. Respected Toastmasters, dear Gavilars and guests, a very good morning to one and all present here. Once there lived an old man who thought that his old wife was hard of hearing. So he called her ENT doctor to get her hearing checked. The doctor said that he could only have an appointment with her after two weeks. Meanwhile, the husband had to do an informal test with his wife to give an insight to the doctor what is the real problem. Here's what you have to do. The doctor began. Stand 40 feet away from your wife and start in a normal conversation. Then wait for a response. If a response is not given, then stand 30 feet and then again wait for a response. If not response given, then continue again and again from 20 feet, 10 feet and so on until you get the response. Saying so, the doctor declined the call. After hearing this, that evening, his wife was in the kitchen and he was at one end of the living room and said to himself, okay, now I'm 40 feet away from her. Let's see what will happen. She said to her wife, honey, what's for supper? No response. He then went to the other side of the room, 30 feet away from her and said, Honey, what's for supper? Again, no response. He then went to the dining room and then asked her, what's for supper? No response again. Then he went into the side of the kitchen door, only 10 feet away from her and said, honey, what's for supper? Again, no response was heard. Then he fast went behind her and said, honey, what for supper? Then she fearfully replied, how many times I told you, it's chicken. Thank you and back to you. Thank you, Gavle Radityan. That was interesting. Monitoring and having timely feedback are key to improve team performance. In order to conduct this session, we have Gavle George Albin as the general evaluator. So please help me welcome Gavler George Talbin. Thank you, Gavler of the day, Gavler Devanand. Very good morning to one and all present here. I'm Gavler George, your general evaluator for today's meeting. So the role of a general evaluator is to keep track of the proceedings of the meeting and make a report on it and submit once they're called upon 
done by the Cavalier of the day. So what I'll be doing is I'll be keeping an eye throughout the entire meeting. I'll be making sure that everything is running smoothly and I'll be making a report on it. And I will also submit the report when I'm called upon. Thank you. Thank you, Gabriel George Albin, for the brief explanation. Behind any successful team, there is a leading light. This team's leading light is our parliamentarian, DTM NC Mani, sir. DTM NC Mani, sir, could you please acknowledge your presence? I request everybody, uh, when someone is called, please clap or use a virtual clap no, to encourage the speaker. Please. Anyone who is called, please clap. Thank you. Sure, sir. We will follow that now onwards. Thank you, sir, for your presence. Now, let's move on to the performance session. Today, we will be having two prepared speakers. Our first speaker is Gavlier Tane Prakash. His speech title is My Memories. Before I call the speaker, I would like to invite his evaluator, Gavlier Ishant Ramasamy, to explain the objective of his speech title and categories. Thank you, Gyavori of today. Good morning, dear elite Gyavoriers. Once again, today, Gyavoriers Tane is delivering the CC1. Her speech title is My Memories. The objectives of her speech are to begin speaking before an audience to discuss speaking skills you already have and the skills that need some attention. Time limit is four to six minutes. All the best, Gary Tanay. Now I invite our first speaker, Gavilier Tanay Prakash. Boy was born on 28 March 2013 at Almana Hospital, Daham. His parents named him Tanay. Who was that poor boy? Yes, it's me, Tanay. Dear Gavalier of the day, fellow Gavaliers, respected Toastmasters and distinguished guests, good morning. My father is Dutya Prakash, who works for Yusabin Ahmad Khanu, Daham. My mother, Reshma, was a teacher, but now housewife, but teaching to her adorable children. Who are they? Me and my sister, Gavalia Tanya. My sister is my best friend and at times enemy too. We play together and sometimes we fight each other, getting good scolding from my mother. We hail from Kannur, Kerala southern part of India. I am studying in third grade in International Indian School, Dhamma. My favorite subjects are my favorite subjects are English and Mathematics. My favorite teachers are Gina teacher and Adya teacher. Gina teacher gave me a chance to participate in KG Day program. One incident in your KG, one of my friends got B grade in exam and he told me to help him since I had A grade. I gave my answer sheet to him. Gina teacher understood the she warned us and informed our parents. My, my hobbies are drawing, watching cartoons, and I am a music student too. I won first place in drawing and coloring competition in UKG and grade 2. My favorite foods are pizza and noodles. Jackfruit and mango fruit are delicious to me. One day, my father brought a big and tasty jackfruit from Grand Hyatt. 
hypermarket. That day, I had a lot of jackfruits and stomach pain too. Animals are my weakness. I used to like dogs. One, one vacation time, one day, I was walking from our home to my uncle's home. A stray dog ran after me and tried to bite me and I started crying. Some people came and saved me. That was horrible experience. From that onwards, dogs are my enemies. Now my favorite pets are cats. In Panda Park, there are many cats and most of them are my friends. My father wants me to be a IAS officer. My mother's ambition is that I should be a IPS officer. Whom should I choose? When I grew up and know what to do in my life. Do you all agree? Back to you. Wow, that was an amazing speech, Gavlar Tanne. Our second speaker is Gavlar Arif Muhammad. His speech title is Glimpses of My Life. Before I call the speaker, I would like to call his evaluator, Gavlar Adityan, to explain the objectives and timings. Thank you, Gavlar of the day. Respected Toastmasters, Gavliers and guests, a good morning once again. Today, Gavalier Arif Muhammad Salim is going to deliver his CC1 speech title, Glimpses of My Life. Time is four to six minutes with the grace of 30 seconds. The objectives of CC1 icebreaker speech are to begin speaking before an audience, to discover speaking skills you already have and the skills that need some attention. Over to you, Gavalier of the day. Thank you, Gavlar Adityan. Now I invite our second speaker, Gavlar Arif Muhammad. Distinguished Toastmaster, fellow Gavliers and guests, a bright and energetic good morning to one and all. No matter how old we become, we could never forget those beautiful memories that we had when we were just young. At some point of time, you will have to reveal them to the world. So today on this fantabulous occasion, I will be taking you on a journey of my life. So what is the delay? Buckle up, get in the time machine, and let's go to the past. My name is Arif Mohammed Salim. I'm studying in sixth grade in Al Kuzama International School. I was born in Kollam, Kerala on 29 July 2010. My family consists of three members. My father, my mother, and my brother. My father works in a university. He's a lecturer. Raise your hands if you have an understanding and amazing father. Put the more together, you get my dad. My mother is a housewife. She teaches us, takes care of us, and is always there with us. Again, raise your hands if you have strict but get loving and charming mother. Put them all together, you get my mom. I have a brother who's studying in ninth grade in Al Kuzama International School. Even though my family just consists of three members, I love my family so much. For example, lately, my father took me and my brother to ride a desert bike on the desert. I mean, that's so cool. And when I was in third grade, my father took our family to to, to, to take pity. The take me tour was pretty much cool. We saw a lot of monkeys, and we also went on an elephant ride and a jeep safari. Now you might be thinking, you just said your past moments, not your present, like your daily routine. What about that? Well, don't worry, because I have the list. I wake up every day for Fajr prayer and I sleep again because I'm tired. Then I wake up again at 8 o'clock to get ready for school. I brush my teeth, take a bath, dress up and attend school. After school, I eat my lunch and study again. 
at 6 o'clock in the evening, I drink tea, do makar prayer, read the Quran, and learn. At 7, I do pray Isha prayer, then I take a bath. At 9, my brother watches TV, and at 10, we sleep. You also may have another doubt running through your mind. So, what are your hobbies, your ambitions, what do you want to become? This is just rotten tomato, right? Well, if you want to know about me so much, then I will say my list too. My hobbies are playing the piano, cycling, reading books, watching television, and playing football. My favorite, I especially adore sci-fi novels. My favorite author is Arthur C. Clarke, and my favorite book is Rendezvous with Rama. My ambition is to become an IPS officer, but not just any IPS officer, an IPS officer who works for the welfare of the people, serves people in need, helps the people who is truthful, honest, and hardworking. Once again, I'm Arif, and these are the glimpses of my life. That was a splendid speech, Javler Arif. Now, please help me invite the timer, Javler Ayan, to give the time by each speaker. Good morning once again. Timer for the timing for the first speaker, Javler Tane, was four minutes five seconds. And second speaker, Javler Arif, took five minutes. And 27 seconds. Thank you, Thank you, Gavler Ayan. Now, please help me invite the vote counter to conduct the voting session for the best speaker. Dear Gavaliers, you can send your vote to me in the chat and please ensure that you direct message and you are not mistakenly sending it to everyone. In the meantime, you can uh, proceed, uh, dear Kevlar of the day. Okay, sir. Teams shall be well trained to accustom with any surprises. This is well done through our table topic session. To conduct this session, please help me welcome Kevlar Abhinav Gorantala as our table topic master. I think Gavler Abhinav is uh, facing some internet issues. Is anyone ready to conduct a table topic session? If anyone is there, raise your hand quickly. You are all senior Gavaliers. Why well, you are taking this much time to say yes? I can do it. Yes. Okay. Dear President, go ahead. Thank you, sir. Good morning to one and all present here. I am Gavya Asim, and I will be the table topic master for today. 
Table Topics is a session where you are given a topic on the spot and you are requested to speak for it for one to two minutes. May I request that? Uh, I'm sorry to uh, interrupt, dear, dear uh, Gavalier Asim. Dear Gavaliers, kindly send all your ballots since our Gavalier Abinov, who is the vote counter, is not present here. Please send it to our Gavalier George Alvin. Dear George Albin, please yes. take care about voting and let me know sure. the results so that I will prepare the certificates. Thank sure. you so much. Thank you. you may proceed, dear Gavler Asi. Thank you, sir. In table topics, you are given a topic on the spot and you are requested to speak for one to two minutes. As said by our timer, one minute shows green card, one minute 30 shows yellow card and two minutes shows red card. So here I will be giving you some one word topics and everyone is requested to speak about that topic. Our first speaker will be Gavilya Ishan Ramasamy. Yes. Gavilya Ishan, are you ready? Okay, Gary Ishant, your topic is cats. I repeat, your topic is cats. Can you repeat? Can you put it in the chat? I'm unable to hear. Okay. Cats, C A T S. Yes, cats. Oh, cat. Okay. Thank you, Table Topic Master, for a wonderful topic. Good morning, the elite galleries and my respected guests. Cats, while thinking about it, I actually learned a lesson in my English textbook about cats. I actually learned about dogs, but my mom explained that cats live for their surroundings and they don't do anything to the, uh, anything to the owner. They just live for the surroundings and for the well-being. But if you come to see about the dogs, dogs, always helps her master in any ways. Even I have seen in a YouTube video about a cat being simply sitting uh, while a owner has uh, one dog and a cat. While he gets a heart attack, a dog comes near him and saves his life. While his other cat is sitting down and laying on the bench and then just sitting. The cat leaves for the surroundings. The cat doesn't help in any way. But Still, while saying cat, I have before had a cat and it looks so cute, but I don't like it because sometimes it does some things which are not so good, well, according to me. But while saying about cat, I like to say it's a cute pet. Yes, we can have it in our surroundings while leaving, but we need to have a big house so that the cat doesn't do anything naughty, which makes the house big dirty house so i like to end my speech by saying that cats are also pretty good thank you ishan ramasamy that was a wonderful speech about cats though it changed to dogs so now i have a doubt about which to own should i own a dog or should i own a cat anyway we'll keep that away our next speaker will be gavilia ruben jacob who is going to be there. Your topic is cars, C-A-R-S, cars. I hope you're ready for it. Thank you, President. Uh, uh, growing up, every boy, child, male child will be obsessed with cars. You will at least have one, two cars. Some, uh, even I have a collection of cars when I was seven, six. Uh, from the company Hot Wheels. I hope everyone knows that. They make uh, really designed cars uh, which are fun to play with. Uh, they make tracks and all race tracks to play. So these uh, cars, basically, they're a vehicle that we use in our daily lives. If you want to go to the shopping mall, to the theater, anywhere we want, a car is always there to help us. Only one, uh, this some disadvantages because there's a limit to how much space we have in the car. Like we can't bring a family of 20 people or anything. And if you want to travel a long distance, like for one, from one country to another, of course, we can't use a car. A car 
works on land. Like, I really wish they would make some flying cars or anything. It would be easier. Uh, so, uh, uh, I always, uh, when I was small, I always buy cars from the shopping malls. And currently, I have like 158 or something of these Hot Wheels cars. Uh, one time, I even found a car lying on the ground, like a toy car just on the ground. So I picked it up, cleaned it, and uh, it's a really cool, uh, what do you call, a Mustang. Yeah, it's a Mustang car. It looks really cool blue. So yeah, I would like to end my speech here. Thank you. Thank you, Ruben. That was such an amazing explanation about cars. And Ruben, may I ask you, is this your first time speaking or have you sp uh, spoken somewhere before? Uh, in, uh, in my old school uh, for like science, na uh, National Science Day, uh, Gita Ma'am would always insist me speaking. Uh, Devan uh, remembers because he used to be he's in Dunes. So, oh. uh, yeah, so it's not my first time speaking. Oh, that's great. So Devan and then you were like classmates before? Uh, not exactly classmates, we were in the same division. That's amazing. Now, on to the Anybody next speaker. Please, please clap for Rebun. Okay, now on to the next speaker, we have Rishit. Rishit, your topic is games. G-A-M-E-S, games. And I hope, I know you will know a lot about it because there's no one here who does not play a game. Everyone plays it. So Rishit, your topic is games. You can start when you're ready. Thank you, Devi Narasi. Good, good morning, everybody. Today, I'm going to talk about games. So games is thing uh, that we all like. And there's nobody in this meeting that does not know about games. And everybody plays games. Let, well, there are two types of games, indoor games and outdoor games. Indoor games are the games that we play inside our homes. It, it can include all kinds of board games and family games. Like board games include chess, carom, ludo, snake and ladders, and many more. Uh, family games are like Chinese whispers, and there are many more. Outdoor games include the games that we play outside our houses. They include games like football, Chair, uh, football, chair, uh, basketball, volleyball, and swimming. We also play video games. Video games can make us a little bit couch potato, but can also improve our mental ability and also our math skills. Now, let me tell you about the importance of games. Games help us to learn many moral values like the teamwork, team spirit, fair play, and honest play. It also tells us that winning or losing is not the part of games, but it is about how we play the game in an honest manner. It also helps us to feel refreshed and enthusiastic and also helps us to get a mental strength. Okay, now let me tell you the game that I like. I like football. It's a level player game with two groups and it's a game where we kick the ball in order to score a goal. Well, in conclusion, I would like to tell that games is a really important vital part of our life. Thank you. Thank you, Galia uh, Ishrishit. That was an amazing performance. Please, everyone, give a round of applause to Galia Ishrishit. These Alkazama Gavaliers are going to make us senior Gavaliers look like small pieces of cakes. But let's move on to the next one. So, Gav uh, Mohamed Hassan, I'd like to call Gavalier Mohamed Hassan. And your topic would be uh, pens. I repeat, your topic would be pens. Since every one of us use pens and there are so many different varieties of pens, I believe it's not, it's just a simple piece of cake to say about pens. Even I could say it uh, blindly. So, Mohamed Hassan, are you ready to amaze us all and to flabbergast us? Yes, I am ready. Stop when you are ready. Good morning, everyone. I am Mohamed Hassan and I am going to talk about pens. Pens is important in our life. It is used to write. It, it 
it helps us to write. We hold pens with our hand. It helps us to write exams. There are different colors of pens. I like pens. I do drawings with the pens. I do sketch with the pens. A pen is mightier than a sword. Thank you. Thank you, Gabriel Hassan. That was okay. You know, everyone has their own ups and downs, but we will be uh, great when we go to Toastmasters, Gabriel Clubs and all. So don't worry about it. Our next speaker would be Gavalier. Any, many, many more, please. Kaja. Gavalier Kaja. Your topic is time. I repeat, your topic is time. Now, since everyone here has some of the other forms of time, they can think of wasting time or gaining time or something like that. But we just don't want, uh, because once we lose time, we cannot get it back. So time is one of the most important things that we need to discuss. So Galia Kaja, are you ready to talk about time? Galia Kaja, I also request to turn on your videos so that we can see how well you perform as well. Galia Kaja, are you there? Change the speaker, please. Okay, sir. So we'll give the same topic to Gavalier Andrew. Gavalier Andrew. Your topic is time. Are you ready to speak about it? Okay, you are ready to speak about it? Yes. Good, keep up that confidence. Stop when you're ready. Good morning, everybody. My topic uh, is about time. I'm going to be speaking about time. Mm. Uh, time uh, waits for no one. Like uh, uh, you can even see the time uh, on Gavilar Ion screen. Uh, time is very precious because once you lose it, you cannot get it back. Everyone is uh, equal in uh, front of time. Mm -hmm. So uh, don't waste uh, the time that you have. Thank you. Thank you, Andrew. That was a great speech about time. But though it has to be limited to that time, well, it was a great speech. We can all agree with that. And one of the main points is that once time is lost, we can gain it back. So always keep that in mind. Our next speaker will be Gavalier Zaid Zafar. Gavalier Zaid Zafar, your topic is pets. If you like pets, then that means this will be a great topic. 
Thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Mohammed Zaid, and today I am going to present the topic pets. Pets are really important for us some of the times. There are many types of pets: fish, goldfish, uh, cats, dogs, and rabbits, etc. First of all, dogs are really important as a pet. Also, there are some kinds of dogs which protect us. many times against thieves and they also inform us about uh, dangers when uh, during natural disasters dogs can detect these kinds of disasters and inform us so that we can prepare cats also are important an example if you are in a how in your house and a rat comes a cat can save you from the rat or any other insect or mosquito or cockroaches now about fishes fish are also important many people love fish and they keep fish tanks in their house they look really cute and the fish are also very uh, fun to play with thank you and have a nice day Thank you, Gabriel Said Safar, for talking about pets and discussing about the three kinds of pets. That was amazing. Now, our next speaker would be Nini Nini Mani Mo, the speaker that you know, Joel George. Gabriel Joel George, your topic would be um, mobile phones. That's right. Yeah, mobile phones. So, tell me, Gabriel Joel. Do you have a mobile phone with you? No, I don't mean your mother's or your father's mobile phone, but you are do you have your own mobile phone with you? I'm oh, sorry, I got disconnected. Can you repeat? Okay. Gavlia Joel George, your topic is mobile phones. So tell me, Gabriel Joel, do you have a mobile phone as your own, or you? No. Oh, you don't have it. But it's okay. Still, you know more about mobile phones. So let's get. So Gabriel Joel, are you ready to speak about mobile phones? Yes. All right. Then start whenever you're ready. Good morning, everyone. My name is Joel Matthew George. Today, I'm going to talk about mobile phones. Mobile phones are thing which almost everyone has. Everyone uses. You go into markets, you see vendors, farmers. Almost everyone has a phone, mobile phone. It's a common thing now. Every year, new phones get released. People buy according to it. Mobile phones have advantages and disadvantages. One main advantage is that you can talk to anyone. There is phone. You can call anyone. Um, you can use social media and all. But disadvantages, social and me, social medias, which which is found in phones, are bad for you. Sometimes it may lead to bad things. There is also a, a amount of huge amount of radiations coming from mobile phones. Yeah, yesterday, um, incident that occurred is yesterday. I kept my phone in the room, and my mother came in uh, asking. Keep the mobile somewhere else, cause my mother said there'd be a amount of. Uh, it's not good for you to keep the phone in your room while you're sleeping. What's it cause? Because it causes radiation. Thank you. Thank you, Gabriel Joel George. That was an amazing uh, speech about mobile phones, the advantages and disadvantages. Now. Our next speaker would be. Um, let's go with Subhan. Subhan, your topic is books. Now, most of us don't read books; we read Kindle. So it's going to be a pretty, I think, going to be a pretty hard topic. So, Subhan, your topic is books. Are you ready? Yes. Keep up that good confidence. Start when you're ready. Good morning, everyone. My name is Subhan Khan, and today I'm going to speak about the topic books. Books are very important for us. 
they are a uh, key to knowledge we learn many things from them uh, uh, there are many interesting stories and also uh, there are also uh, many various genes of them and then they also help us be curious and we learn many different things from and uh, my favorite story will be the harry potter story as i love harry potters and uh, yeah thank you thank you gavin lee uh, subhanka and that was a great uh, speech about books our final speaker would be uh Gavilya Khaja Gavilya Khaja your topic is what you can you use the topic mm. okay your topic is uh social media i repeat your topic is social media nowadays we all have facebook whatsapp twitter instagram and all but do we know what are the advantage advan, uh, advantages and disadvantages of it so if not we have kaja to explain about the social media platform good morning uh, good morning uh, i'm kaja today i'm going to tell you about the topic social media as you all know the social media platform such as facebook instagram twitter and whatsapp are gaining important these days as they are trying to get people worldwide to just uh, click a button If you look in the positive impact of social media, there are various disadvantages. Of one of the major advantage of social media is that it's full of information and helps in providing ed education. For example, children approach social media to get information on a desired topic. It's a great device for education. It has made this education possible. We can attend a lecture happen in the some other part of the world by just sitting in front of screen of a country. Is that isn't that great? Social media uh, is also very convenient to stay updated about what is happening around the around us. We uh, we don't need to get wait for a newspaper to give us information. There's various there, there are various news related applications that that, uh, that can instantly update us about any serious happening around around us. Social media has also created uh, opportunities for people to show uh, their talent. Thank you. Wow, that is an amazing performance, Kaja. So tell me, is this your first time, or do have you practice speaking somewhere else, or in your school or somewhere? First time. Wow. I mean, okay. To be honest, he's even better than me. I fumble up my words whenever I'm speaking like this. So. great job kaja and i hope to see i see a better future in you in the field of speaking great job can we give him another round of applause all right that's it with the table topic session and i hope it was fun filled and amazing to see all of our young budding gavrias speaking so amazing and i hope and i see a great future in the field of speaking in every one of them so go on with this have the same confidence that you have showcased it now and can we have the timers report please yes the speaker gavriel ishan his topic was cats he spoke for 1 minute 35 seconds and second speaker gavriel ruben his topic was cars he spoke for 1 minute 36 seconds and third speaker gavriel rishit his topic was games He spoke for one minute fifty seconds, and the uh, fourth speaker, Gavilar Hassan. His topic was pens. He spoke for about thirty seconds. He had a lot of gaps in between. And fifth speaker, Gavilar Andrew. His topic was time. He spoke for one minute. Wait, we didn't. 
he about he spoke for about 30 seconds he had gaps and six speaker gavier z his topic was pets he spoke for one minute 17 seconds and seventh speaker gavier joel his topic was mobile phones he spoke for one minute 19 seconds and eight speaker gavier subhan his topic was books he spoke for 57 seconds and last speaker gavier khaja his topic was social media. He spoke for one minute, 13 seconds. All are qualified except Subhan, uh, Hassan, and Andrew. Thank you. And back to the table topic, Master. Okay. Thank you so much, Taima. And also, please publish the names of the qualified voters so that we would be, it will be easy for us to cast our votes. And uh, okay, so uh, yeah, uh, the timer. Please publish the names of the qualified voters in the chat box, please, so that we could have uh, the voting session. Okay. Okay. So in the meantime, I give out my role as a, a table topics master hope you had an amazing session ahead and i see i'll see you maybe somewhat in the future thank you and have a nice day ahead wow that was amazing those topics were splendid Asim. now to find out what we have done please help me welcome the general evaluator Gavler george albin Thank you, Gavlier Devanand. Good morning once again. I'm George, your general evaluator. So without any further ado, let's get on with the evaluation session. So first up, we'll have the prepared speech evaluators. And to evaluate Gavlier Tane Prakash, I would like to call Gavlier Ishant Ramasamy to evaluate his speech. Your timing is two to three minutes. Thank you. Thank you, Batamon. You can just see the timer. Just a minute. First of all, uh, put on your camera, Ishan. Also for the inconvenience. Timer, uh, dear, dear timer, Gavile Rayan, can you please put on your camera and uh, show us the timer? Gavile Rayan, Gavile Rayan, Gavile Rayan. Yes, sir. Please put on your camera and show us the timing card. Thank you. Can you see? Just yes. Can I start? Yes. Good morning, Cavaliers, and a special good morning to our blooming bird, Cavaliers, Sunny. What a speech. You started with a great opening by introducing yourself and about your family while sharing your personal experience. It was an amazing feeling to the audience. We felt that we were with you while you were explaining about, the, about your life, about your Introduction, that's what we need an icebreaker. Well done. And in the body, you spoke about your experience about your teachers, favorite teachers, and also about your ambition and about your experience going to your uncle's house. It was really nice to hear your personal story. I really appreciate it. Keep going with that. And you also spoke about your ambition which shows that how, how your dedication to deliver a speech, it was really amazing. Keep up the good work. In the delivery, I would like to say that you spoke very well. You had a great opening, a great body, and a great conclusion. 
by giving an humor to the audience well done you ended your speech with a humor by telling different wishes by your parents you want to become in your future about your ambition well done kudos to you and coming to the improvement side i have few improvements please note my humble suggestions so you could have said a few things in the starting we could have said the opening in one place and in the body you could have if you would have done that your speech would be to the next level overall you gave an amazing speech kudos to you well done and keep up the good work i am sure that i am looking forward to listen to your future speeches and thank you and back to the gentle volito Thank you so much, Gavilier Ishant, for that wonderful evaluation. I'm sure that Gavilier Tane will take all your humble suggestions and work on his speeches in the future. Thank you. Next up, to evaluate Gavilier Arif, would like to call another wonderful evaluator, Gavilier Adityan, to evaluate his speech. Thank you, General Evaluator. The secret of getting ahead is getting started. Hold on, uh, sorry. I'm sorry, dear uh, Gavilier Adityan. Gavilar Ayan, where is your uh, timing card? One minute, sir. What are you doing? Ayan, don't switch off your uh, video. We cannot see your uh, timing card. Okay, I have okay. some internet issues. I keep turning off. Okay, please carry on, uh, dear uh, Aditya. Thank you, sir. The secret of getting ahead is getting started. Respect to Toastmasters, Gavilar said yes. A very good morning once again. Dear Gavilliers, hasn't Gavillier Arif served full justice to the quote I just said? Yes, he has, and indeed in an elated manner. Gavillier Arif, believe me, I haven't seen anyone in my life who delivered a CC1 in such a perfect manner. In the sense of perfect, I mean that you didn't give me a chance, a single chance. to even find an error or a mistake in your speech in my cc1 all i did was stand in the center of the stage full of butterflies in my stomach with no hand gestures no stage movement no facial expression or voice modulation i didn't even have eye contact as i just stared at the chair in front of me while you had all the qualities enough for cc10 right in the beginning of your journey one of the objectives of cc1 are to discover speaking skills that you already have and skills that need some attention and i think that you have discovered that you are capable of all the qualities for a perfect crisp speech and i am not boasting i really mean it as every coin has two sides i also have one suggestion for you when you ask the question on who has sweet and kind mothers and told us to raise our hands you could have waited for the audience's response to make them more involved and attentive in your speech for cc1 you have included and met all the objectives from the cc manual but this suggestion was just for your future speeches and contests otherwise you have done an elated job in completing your cc1 thank you and over to you general evaluator Thank you, Gavilar Adityan, for that wonderful evaluation. I'm sure that Gavilar Arif feels really elated after those wonderful praises you've showered upon him. Thank you. Now let's move on to the table topics evaluator. Before I call him, timer, may I know how many speakers were there so that we can calculate the time? Yes, uh, there were nine speakers. There were nine speakers, so so five minutes. Totally five, five minutes. Five, total five. Yeah. To totally five minutes. Yes. So now I would like to call another wonderful evaluator, Gavilar Abdul Rahman, to evaluate each and every table topic speaker. Thank you. Thank you, Gavilar George Albin. Now I should begin the table topics evaluation session, but with Gavilar Shah. Gavilar Shah, you had spoken an amazing speech. Uh, with amazing was modulation. but you had given uh, spoke really good but there was only one thing you had been given the topic cats uh, and you had 
spoken about cats and dogs. As you were given the topic cats, you should have spoke more about cats. Thank you. And now, Gavier Jacob, you had been given the topic cars. As you've already spoken in various places, you had an amazing voice modulation and spoke about how every male is obsessed with cars. Thank you. Now, Gavle Risit, you spoke with an amazing voice modulation and spoken about your favorite game, as me, I do love games. And you had talked about your favorite game, which is football. Now, Gavle Muhammad, you had been given uh, the topic pen and you spoke about the different colors and spoke really well. And you had said an, a beautiful quote at the end of your speech. Gavriel Andrew, you had been given the topic time and talked how time lost cannot be regained. And that was really, really good. Gabriel said, you had been given the topic pets and talked about how dogs can sense natural disasters before they uh, come and about fishes and gave us a lot of knowledge we will now keep in mind. Gabriel Joel, you had been given the topic mobile phones. You talked about how they release radiation and are harmful to us. And from now on, I will make sure not to sleep with, uh, with the phone at the same room, in the same room. Gabriel Subhan, you had been given the topic books and you spoke about how books are the key to knowledge and gave us a lot of knowledge. And you spoke about how your favorite book is Harry Potter's. And now, the last but not least, Gavriya Khaja. You had been given the topic social media. You had spoken how you can use social media to be, to be updated about the news all around the world and how, we can, how can people can show their talents to the whole world and, told we can, and how we can utilize social media Thank you. And back to you, Gavler, General Evaluator George Alvin. Thank you, Gavler Abdul Rahman, for that wonderful evaluation. But Gavler Abdul Rahman, if I were in your shoes, I would have added a few more recommendations and recommendations. And so that we can exceed the time, I mean, we can come to the time limit and the speakers can get more information about their speech and work on it even more. So if we can add a little more suggestions for the speakers to work on from their speeches, I feel like that would be a very good addition to your evaluation. But nonetheless, it was a really good evaluation and thank you for that. Now to check our Thanks. grammar, if we were grammatically correct and we followed all the rules, I would like to call our grammarian, Gavlier Asim, to for the grammarian's report. Thank you, General Evaluator Gavlier George. I am kind of happy and kind of sad to say that only five people in our meeting had used the word elate. Uh, I don't know if I'm wrong, but please correct me. Uh, Gavlier George has used it one time. Gavlier Devanand has used it two times. Gavlier Ishan has used it two times. Gavlier Asim, that's me, has used it uh, two times. And Gavlier Aladdin, two times. So today, now I would like to speak about the, be uh, the best uh, sentences in our meeting and also some improvements that we need to do. So some of the best uh, good points are Intrusive Gavalier, elucidate us, fantabulous occasion, couch potato, click of a button. Once time is lost, we can't get it back. Now on to some improvements. Today, I am going to be the vote counter for today. So today here is used two times, which is quite ambiguous. I will be the vote counter for today's session or meeting. That's much better. My role today is of the listening master. Or let's make it sound a bit more better. Today, I will be the listening master. Sounds quite good. 
one of my friends got C grade. Hmm, kind of weird. Mm, let me just change it. Yeah, one of my friends got a C in his exams. That's much better, though long, but it's good to understand. My favorite food is pizza and noodles. Let me try to change this. Sounds very basic. Hmm. Pizza and noodles are my favorite food. That's much better. Even though my family consists three members. Let me just correct it. Even though my family consists of three members. That's great. That was horrible experience. That doesn't sound right. It was a horrible experience. Now it sounds better. Pens is important in our lives. Should we use is before a plural, or after a plural word? Well, let me just change it. Pens are important in our lives. Now it's much better. I do drawings with the pen. I do sketches with the pen. Two sentences seem a bit too long. Let me try changing it. Uh, yeah, I draw and sketch using pens. That's much more concise and shorter. During natural disasters, dogs can detect the disasters. Huh? That's pretty weird. Let me change it. Dogs can detect natural disasters and warn us. Hmm, that's much better. These are all for the improvement section. And I hope you can take all my humble suggestions and uh, will use it in your future speeches. My general recommendation is to not be, con don't jumpstart it whenever you're having a speech or when you're in a table topics, don't jumpstart. This will cause you to fumble up with your words and will not make it look very good. So always take a deep breath and then start up with your speech. Just take a deep breath. Inhale, exhale, and then start it. So you'll have a clear and free mind and all the ideas will flow like a river. Thank you and have a nice day ahead. Wow, that was an amazing grammarian report, Gavilya Rasim. And I will request everyone to give a wonderful round of applause for him. Thank you. Now, to keep note of all the ahs, ums, long pauses, repeated words, and all the grammatical errors and filler words, I would like to call Gavli Muttasim as the R counter. Good morning, dear Gavli, again. First of all, Gavli Thane had one pause and nothing else. Then Gavli Arif also had nothing. Gavli Abhinav had one a. Uh. Gavli Asim had one a uh, and one um. Gavli Ishan had one a. Uh. Gavilier Ruben had seven a. Uh. Gavilier Rishit had one like. Gavilier Hassan had one pause. Gavilier Andrew had one like. Gavilier Joel George had one um. Gavilier Shubham had one pause. And Gavilier Khaja also had nothing. Thank you. Thank you, Gavilier Mathasim, for that detailed report. And now I hope that each and every one of us can improve on our speeches in the future. Now, to keep track of our listening skills, I would like to call the listening master for today, that is Gavlir Ishant Ramasamy. Thank you, Jinder Walita, for the... Thank you, Jinder Walita. Now, today, let us begin our listening master session. So, my first question is, what is Gavlir Rishit? Favorite game. I will repeat. What is Gavli Rishit's favorite game? This question I would like to ask to Gavli Asim. Uh, Gavli Rishit's favorite game is football. Yes, correct. What is what does Gavli Muhammad Hassan do with the pen? I would like to ask this question to Gavli Tane. Okay, let's proceed. I'd like to ask this question to Gavli Zaid Zafar.
स्केचेस एंड ड्रॉइंग्स यस करेक्ट थैंक यू व्हाट इज द मीनिंग ऑफ द वर्ड ऑफ द डे सेड बाय द ग्रामरियन टुडे आई लाइक टू आस्क दिस क्वेश्चन टू गैली ऑफ द डे गैली देवानंद Uh, the word of the day is elite, and it means to make someone happy. Yes, correct. Thank you. What did Gavle Andrew, our table topic speaker, speak today? I repeat, what did Gavle Andrew speak about? This question I would like to ask you, Gavle said, for example. Gavle Andrew spoke about time. Yes, correct. So all have good listening. Keep it up, Gavle. Yes. What is the theme of the day? This I would like to ask this question to everyone. What is the theme of the day? Together we learn. Oh. Together we grow. Learn together. Learn together. Together we learn. Learning together. together. Yes, good. Now I like to ask the last question. What was Gavli Zaid's first topic? I repeat, what was Gavli Zaid's first topic? I would like to ask this question to Gavli. या है या है आई लाइक दिस क्वेश्चन टू गैवरी या है ओके इफ नॉट वी विल प्रोसीड विल आस्क दिस क्वेश्चन टू गैवरी जेकब व्हाट इज गैवरी जेड द फर्स्ट टॉपिक सॉरी फॉर द इंसिडेंट ओके इफ नॉट आई लाइक दिस टू गैवरी काजा पेट्स Pets. Yes, correct. Thank you, and I would like to end the section session. Back to Rishan Devoli. Thank you, Gavli Rishan, for that uh, li listening test. Now I would like to uh, have the timers report, and before that, uh, the the voting for the table topic session was not done, I believe. So I request everyone to cast your votes to Gavli Ravina for the table topic session. And now the timers report, and then we can have the voting for the evaluation. Okay, the first evaluator. Gavilar Ishant spoke for two minutes ten seconds. Qualified. Second evaluator Gavilar Adityan spoke for two minutes. Qualified. And table topic evaluator spoke for two minutes thirty seven seconds. And grammarian Gavilar Sim spoke for three minutes fifty eight seconds. uh thank you uh, timer so dear gavilias kindly cast your votes to gavilier abina uh, please don't send them to me thank you now i'll be submitting my report so the meeting started a few minutes late but it's fine as it's the first meeting but in toastmasters we must be very punctual as it's one of the qualities we developed from toastmasters and what we learned in our sessions the word of the day was displayed properly and the grammarian explained it properly which made it easy for us to understand about the word and to use it in our day to day life all the role players did a good job there were not many hindrances in the meeting which is a good sign even though one of our role player was facing some network issue gavli asim was not hesitant hesitant to take up the role which is an appreciable move please give him a round of applause So this shows the spontaneous spontaneous actions of us gaveliers which is necessary in today's world. Everyone did a good job and I congratulate all of you. Everything ran smoothly until now and all the timings and everything were perfect. And I really appreciate you all and that was my report for now and I hope the voting is happening right now and once that's over the vote counter can declare the results and I hand over the control of the lectern back to the gavelier of the day. Thank you, General Evaluator Gavler George Albin. Teamwork doesn't guarantee success, since teamwork is not the only factor which decides success. But teamwork will definitely increase our chance of success. So, dear Gavliers, let us learn and grow together. Thank you, and back to the President. Thank you, Gavler. They are gather the day gather the day one and so gatherers. Did you like the session today? Yes. Everyone unmute and say yes. It's not a problem. Yes. 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 Louder, louder. Say louder. Yes. 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 Okay, that's the enthusiasm. So can we just all give a huge round of applause to our gallery of the day gallery day one and unmute your mics and do it. <laughs> Okay
Okay, so now I would like uh, now what are we missing something? Mm. Yes, voting. Yes. So have you all? Uh, so for the evaluator voting, I, I guess it is, has everyone voted for the evalu best evaluator? Excuse me. Yes. Uh, I have a doubt. Can the table topic speakers also vote? Yes. Yes. Of yes. course. Thank you. Yes. So well, so let, let's wait for the voting and uh, the vote counting Gavri Abhinav, if we have received the results, please say yes, so that we could uh, recognize it and move on. So until then, let's hear from our uh, budding Gavaliers of al Kuzam International School, al Kuzam Gavel Club, sorry. And so let's start with Syed Farzan. How did you like this meeting, what, what we have done now? Yes, so good morning to one and all present here. I really loved this meeting as it was the first meeting and our young Gavilliers who uh, took admission in the Gavils Club, they got to know about uh, Gavils Club a lot and thanks to all the role players who performed it in a great manner. And I think this will be very helpful for our young blooming Gavilliers and I may see all these Gavilliers shining in the sky as stars in the future. Thank you. That's great. Amazing. Now, Gavilier Nehan, please say your experience about this meeting. Yeah, good morning. So the Gavilier's Club, uh, today's Gavilier's session was a very interactive one and it helped, up, uh, helped us improve our communication skills and provided us uh, with good information about speaking. Yeah, thank you. Great, great. Now, Gavilier Abdul Rashid, please uh, say your experience that you have got from this meeting. Uh, I ran. I just got a how Gavilier works, how Gavilier Club uses our vocabularies, and I just saw my friends are attending, and I got a good and I have good future. For the Gavilliers, thank you. That's amazing, Gavilliers. Now, now let us hear from some of our Toastmasters and teachers who have been here. So, Toastmaster Alvin Alvin Joseph, sir, can you please uh, tell us about our performance during this meeting and give us some insight on the improvements that we have to make? Thank you, Acting President uh, Gavilliers Azim. I would, uh, without any hesitation, I should say that I've been elated right from the word go till now, because being a part of this session, which is learning together and growing together, is something which is very much pertinent at this juncture. I would, uh, before I give on my comments or recommendations, I would initially like to thank you all, particularly the Gabaliers of uh, Student Gable Club and Creative Gable Club for having put up this show. And my heartfelt thanks goes out to my close friend in all aspects, DTM Narasimharao, who is the club counselor for Prudent, and another gentleman whom I admire a lot, that is none other than uh, DTM Minzi Mani, who has been the founder of Graham in Creative Club. So the time that these two gentlemen have taken out, despite all the busy schedules, to put this, these two forums in place is something which is admirable in all aspects. I think you all owe a lot to these two people, because it is their passion that, in fact, keeps this bonding together to put up a great show whenever you've been called upon. And I request all the Gavaliers of the newly joined Gavaliers, specifically of Al Kuzama Gavel Club boys, to take out the maximum from what you got today. In fact, this particular session has been custom made for you. You know, to see how a uh, Gable Club works, how the meeting goes. And I think everybody, all the role players of today's session has done justice in all aspects to make this very much appealing and informative for the new Gabriels. Of course, I have been associated with al Kuzama Gable Club since the last couple of years. I've seen a lot of people evolving as leaders. Some of some of the Gabriels have already passed out of this Gabriel and they are within the school itself. I think they will be the torchbearers for taking this session to its newer heights. 
So Gabalius, please learn. Whatever learnings you got today, please hold on to it. Make sure that you take this forward with utmost dedication and sincerity because at the end of the day, it's going to benefit you all. A fabulous job done by the creative and prudent Gable team today. And one particular thing that you need to know is that during the course of the meeting, right from the beginning now, you would have seen different strides of performance. Some young, very young Gabaliers coming up, mustering up the courage and speaking what they wanted to. Some people with a bit of experience showing some maturity. And at times we felt when a need arises, you step in immediately. That is what exactly today Gabaliya Azim has done. So this is all, this is what his leadership is all about. And I'm sure as the journey progresses, you all will, in one day or the other, all in one form or the other, will definitely have an opportunity to rise to the occasions. And once again, it's my pleasure and honor, and I would say I've been completely elated, and I'm sure with the guidance of people in the likes of uh, DTM Narasimha Rao, DTM N. Zimani, and each and every member of this fraternity, Alkazama Gables Club is going to strike new heights. Thank you, and back to you, Gable Yassi. Thank you, sir, for those wonderful words of zeal and aplomb. Now I'd like to request uh, our Toastmaster, Giri, sir, to uh, say his experience and to give us some insight on our improvements and how he felt on our meeting. Thank you, Gavalier Azim Muhammad. You know, I too elated with uh, the wonderful performance of the Gavaliers. And I can tell you as a teacher coordinator of our uh, Al-Khazam International School, and this time, all the children are really passionate. The passion, their passion is really reflected here. Like there are many children like Ruben, Rishit, Shishir, all they you know, they, before the gavel, you know, we, when we were starting the gavel club, they approached me. So when are we going to start the gavel club? So that means, you know, they are such a passionate, you know, they have wanted to start the gavel club. They wanted to improve their communication, communication skill. So these all shows that definitely I can assure you this time the gavel club will be a wonderful session and this uh, gavel club will be moving to another level. And like, you know, Azim was uh, with us for a long time and uh, like Azim, I'm really impressed with Azim's presentation today because I'm proud of you, Azim, and the way you presented the word of the day, elated. Each now, at least the root word you said, the root word, synonyms, antonyms, all these things you just introduced in one slide. So, and in coming in the coming days, uh, you can also can follow the you know, next grammarians or the word of the day who is presenting the word of the day. They can they can utilize use the same method, and the grammarian part you know just one, well presented I assume and overall it was really a, a model extemporary excom, you know ex, exclam, you know what i can say that uh, like uh, an exemplary gavel club session and definitely there are many takeaways from uh, this gavel club to the new gaveliers all the best over to asim thank you sir thank you so much for those words now I would like to call DTM NC Mani, sir, the founding father, to speak about this session today and to give us his words of wisdom. Sir, please. Thank you, Acting President Azim, uh, and uh, my dear fellow Toastmasters, Gavaliers and Gavaliers of upcoming Kosama Gavel Club. First of all, I would like to congratulate all members of Prudent and Creative Gable Club for putting up a wonderful show today. Everybody did uh, their job well. And all the Gavaliers who took part in the table topic session, particularly the Gavaliers from Kozama Club, I think they were wonderful. And definitely, you have a bright future. I am not new to Kozama uh, uh, Gable Club because in 2012, Long back, uh, nine years ago, I was the uh, club coach of al Kozama Gavel Club, and uh, I was able to revive the club uh, in, at that time. And even my daughter was studying in al Kozama school long time back. So Kozama uh, school is very close to my heart. So I request all members of uh, Kozama club uh, uh, that please talk to your mentor, take their help, and do your roles 
and very soon you will be successful i can see that all of you are going to be a great leader and great communicator very soon so all the best to all of you and with that i return the lecture back to the acting president jay murthy thank you thank you sir thank you sir for those words of zeal and applause now i would like to call our dear club counselor to speak some words in front uh, and answer to light the fire of up zeal and aplomb and confidence in our minds because who how can we forget the one who has spent a lot of hours and who has spent a lot of his precious time for us to make this a grand success sir please thank you so much our presiding officer gavelia lasim respected al kojama management toast master gish our last respected division o director toast marshal alvin joseph my dear friend and our respected uh, mentor founder of uh, creative gavel club uh, distinguished toast master nc mani and my dear gaveliers of all the three clubs prudent gavel club creative gavel club and my dears alkojama gaveliers good morning to one and all of course now it's going to be good afternoon i'm really happy because al khazama gavel club was revived with the support of al khazama management as well as our dear friend toshmash albin division board director and with of course all the coordinators of uh, al khazama teachers thank you all for coming up for reviving this alkojama gavel club by giving them the platform for developing their skills of leadership as well as communication skills dear gaveliers of alkojama please this is the platform where you all can utilize these moments and the stage is for you to just develop yourself as our dta mentimony told that just approach your mentors and learn from them observe the meetings how to play the roles and you are all the best of course we are there for you any time any support any suggestions you are all in need we are all there with you just approach us for your development we are there our toast master girish is there toast master albin toast master merlin all these great toast masters are with you all and whenever you are in need just approach all the very best and i would like to extend my gratitude my thanks to our uh, creative gavel club and the prudent gavel club for coming up postponing their scheduled meeting to tyler for this alkojama gavel club demo meeting thank you dear gaveliers you all did great job congratulations and thank you all the very best thank you sir for those amazing words now we have reached the most awaited moment of today's meeting what is it can anyone guess it Voting. Come on, Gavaliers! Show that confidence. Voting. Come on, come on. What? No, no energy, no energy here. Come on, show that energy. Everyone on mute and say. Results. Results. Great, great, great. That's the spirit. Keep the, keep up that spirit all every time, everywhere you go as well. So. to reveal the results of today's meeting i would like to call our dear vote counter gavilia abinav thank you gavilia of the day now the part everyone has been waiting for the results uh does anyone want the results or can we skip it because i'm very skip. tired skip come on gavilia where is the energy come on bring up that energy We want the results. 
We okay, want to know. Have only two people say we are going to skip. We don't want results. Yeah. There's no majority. No majority. We need more energy. Come on, bring up the energy. Unmute and say it. It, it doesn't matter. It is not a matter. Of, it, is, it is not the matter of being shy or anything. Okay, you can do whatever you want. It's not a matter of being shy. Everyone unmute and scream. Not a problem. We want the results. We want the results. We want the results. We want the results. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. That's the spirit. Before excitement mm -hmm. turns into anger, the best prepared speaker is Gavilar Arif. Congratulations, Gavilar Arif. Okay. The best table topic speaker is. Gavilar Ruben. Congratulations, Gavilar Ruben. And the best evaluator, Gavilar Seem. Congratulations, Gavilar Seem. And the best role player is the general evaluator, Gavilar George Albin. Congratulations, Gavilar George Albin. Thank you. And those are the results. I will be passing it back to the giveaway of the day. Uh, okay. Thank you, Gavilier Abhinav. That was an amazing session today. Do we have anything left to discuss? Wait, what? Oh yeah. It is time for a small group photo. Everyone, show up your smiles, be elated, and bring up a small thumbs up. All right, let's see how many are there. Come on. All right, everyone, bring up your thumbs up, show up that smiles in your face. Come on. So, I'll take the photos. Come on, everyone. Smile in three, two, one. Thank you. One more time. One more time. One more. One more. Yeah, William, I'm going to run everyone's on video. Let's go. Three, two, one. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. Is there anything left to discuss? If not, I declare the meeting adjourned. Bye, everyone. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye, everyone. See you next time. Bye. 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 Thank you. Bye.